What's up everybody? It's your boy, Junior in the His House, also known as Reefer Owens, pastor of Oasis Church of the Way. I'm filming this video to let you know where we are as a church, where we are going, what, how, all the things, all your questions, I hope I can answer in this video. So number one, what? We are jumping into a study of the book of Acts. And just like we did last year with the book of Romans, we are using our keyword study Bibles. So if you do not know how to study, if you would like to learn how to study, that is the goal here. We just wanna teach people how to study the Word of God using a very good Bible that will show you how to use the Word of God. Number two, we will be following this book here, I don't know if you can see it better over here, right here. This book, the book of Acts, it is a 12 week study guide and we will be walking through this for the next 12 weeks on Sunday mornings. So if you do not have a keyword study Bible, please text the number 575-222-8985 and we will get a Bible for you. And further, if you'd like a study book and you do not pick it up on a Sunday morning, text me and let me know and we will get some books for you. So you can walk through this study with us even though you may not be here on a Sunday morning. So how did we get here? Basically, three years ago, um, we had just started Oasis and I was reading the book Circle Maker. And while reading the book Circle Maker, one day at work, God stopped me and said, write all this stuff down. And he gave me a vision for the land at Thornton and Yano on the southwest side of the uh, intersection. And he had just painted this picture of all these businesses. There was a movie theater, there's a Chick-fil-A, there's a gym, there's a gymnasium, there's an event space, there's childcare, there's a park, um, just all sorts of things, all sorts of businesses, all sorts of places um, for people to do and be and live in life. And it was called the Oasis. It was like, you know, AMC at the Oasis or, you know, the gym at the Oasis. Um, the park, the oasis, you know, um, anyway, but it was all these things that God had shown me. And he said, this is what I am bringing to Clovis through Oasis Church of the Way. And I was like, that's crazy. That's scary. What do you mean? Um, and basically God just flipped the script on what I knew church to be. And he said, I am building in you guys a group of people that will go out into the community and infiltrate the community through these businesses, through their jobs, through normal everyday life to bring the city back to me. And I was like, cool, I'm here for this. I can do it, you know, we can do this. And so I was like, well, how do we get there? You know, he's like, not yet, I have more. I'm like, what, there's more? He says, yes. So God tells me we will be adopting the schools that are close to this piece of land. Barry, Los Niños, Gaddis, and he says, you start here and twice a semester, you have every teacher who works at these schools, you have them bring their receipts for everything that they purchase for their classrooms. Bring those things to you, bring those receipts twice a semester, we add up their receipts, we write them a check, we feed them brunch, and we call it a day. So it's like, oh Lord, well do we, you know, have a little devotional or anything like that? And he's like, no, just give the people money, give them food, and just say we want to be a blessing to be a blessing. That's it. All you have to do is treat people well. And I'm like, okay, cool, we can do that. So that is part of the vision. What else is part of the vision? God has shown me that we have a shuttle, a business shuttle or a business that is a shuttle through Oasis that will take people to Lubbock, Amarillo, and Albuquerque and drop them off, pick them up from there, bring them back to Clovis, and all they have to do is pay for a tip. All they have to do is pay a tip to the driver because Oasis will be cash flowing all of these things just from the people within the church. And so as these things have been going on, um, I've been reading a book called Ecclesia, 
and I will post a picture in this video. But I've been reading a book called Ecclesia and basically in the book he just talks about the early church and how they were so impactful and why they were so impactful and how he has seen this in modern day cities through the same blueprints and the same steps that they took in Acts. And so as I was reading this book, I was like, oh my gosh, this changes everything. And it legitimately lines up with everything that God has shown me for Oasis and for Clovis. So that is how we got here. Um, the plan is to legitimately transform the people that attend Oasis by just getting them to Jesus, by becoming whole people. Um, there is no coincidence that God has um, lit a fire in me personally for my finances and for generational wealth because we will have that within our church. Multiple people, multiple, multiple families will be building generational wealth for the sake of the kingdom. Because if you have multiple families building generational wealth that is meant to give back into our community, then you don't need to actually beg people every week to pay a tithe. You know what I'm saying? So, um, God said all of these things are coming. All of these things are coming. All of these things are happening. And um, it is just up to us to be obedient. And how do we do that? Through the study of Acts. We will look and see what the early church did, how they became who they became, how they legitimately changed the world, um, and how it got to us today. And now that it is here with us, it is up to us to continue that legacy of what Jesus started um, when he came to earth died, rose from the grave, and when he left earth and what he instructed us to do. So that is how we got here. Every week we will be filming. So this playlist that you are looking at right now after this video will go into an introduction of Acts by Read Scripture or Bible Project as you may know them. Um, and so we will have a playlist. So every week we will add the new study video to the playlist and you can go and you can watch it. I would suggest that you study on a Sunday morning. So if you miss, you know, chapter two on that day, it will be uploaded Sunday night or by Sunday night. And then I would suggest that you watch it the next Sunday on Sunday morning if you are not coming to church. So that way you get to stay in the know unless you make the time during the week. I know for most people, Sunday is already cut out even if they do stay home. And so I would say study on Sunday morning like you would as if you were in church. You'd be a week behind, but you get to study on a Sunday morning uninterrupted like you'd planned or if you were here in person. So that is the what. We're studying Acts. Why? Because God is taking our church legitimately to the next level. Um, yeah, he is taking us to the next level. Our plan of action here at Oasis is engage, engage, equip, and empower. And God has shown us what all of those things look like. And now he is showing us what it looks like to be empowered. God has taught us um, and shown us what it's like and what happens when we engage with him on a Sunday morning, when we engage with those people around us. Um, and then he has shown us what it's like to equip people Bibles, study books, small groups, getting people to Jesus, practical tools, all of these things have been to equip the people of Oasis. And now God is showing us how to empower the people of Oasis so that we collectively, through the power of Jesus, can go out and change this city. So that is our why. Um, and so I just pray that you guys join us, that you take it seriously, that you um, see what God has for all of us. And I don't care where you are or who you are. Um, the body of Christ is bigger than where we go on a Sunday morning. And that is my prayer, that we see that and that we live that and that we can do this for real, for real, um, for the kingdom, that we can legitimately bring heaven to earth and that we can transform lives. But first, we have to transform our lives or our lives have to be transformed first. So that is what is happening. That is where we're going. That is the deal. If you have any questions, please feel free to text T to 575-222-8985 or you can just text your question to 575-222-8985 and um, 
yeah, we're about to get it. Lives are about to be changed and our city is about to be changed and I'm here for it. I love y'all. It is an honor to be your pastor. It is an honor to lead the greatest church of all time. Yeah, it is. Um, I do. I love y'all. Have a great week. Don't let the bed bugs bite. And um, let's get it. Let's change this city. Let's be changed and let's change this city. Y'all have fun and I'll see y'all on the flip. Peace out.